Hi everyone. Welcome to our YouTube channel Vidya Vihanga. As promised before, now we are going to start the lectures on DB2. Now let's move into the topic. As we know that IBM is a company that product that uh, develops different kinds of databases. Till now there are many kinds of databases developed by the IBM, but DB2 is one of them which stands in front of the every other database and leads the way in the present generation of market so now let's see the contents for this video in this video we are going to discuss about a uh, what is a db2 and what are the products of the db2 family and what is the use of db2 family as it is an introductory video first i would like to tell about what is a database a database is nothing but an organized collection of data where the updation deletion insertion and also retrieval and many other process can be done on a huge amount of data simultaneously by reducing the redundancy now let us see what is db2 as we know that ibm develop many databases db2 is one among the family of database servers that was developed by the ibm and we also know that there is one more database that that is called informix that runs on the relational database management system but we don't discuss about the rdbms in this i mean we don't discuss about the informix in this as our concentration is mainly on db2 in the beginning a db2 is a platform dependent like it will be supported only on the platforms that was developed by the ibm but in the later on stages there are many products of uh, db2 family where it runs on multiple platforms now let us see what are the products of the db2 family that we are using in the present generation which runs on multiple platforms one of the first product is a db2 luw and the second one is db2 zos which that is a mainframe and the third one db2 ios that is a power system now let us see about the db2 luw what is the luw represent in this db2 luw l represent linux u represent unix and w represent windows so db2 luw is a one that is mostly used now in the organizations in the it industries so luw stands for linux unix and windows and that is what our main concentration in this lecturer videos continuously will work on the db2 luw and the next one is db2 zos that is a mainframe and to know about this the db2 zos that is db2 zos is mostly used by the organizations for running the critical applications that holding a huge amount of data where many data processing techniques is used and a db2 ios is used on the ibm power systems which is a platform dependent so now let us see what is the use of a db2 a db2 is used in the small and the medium organizations for storing their data because the working of db2 is far better than compared to the previous databases that was developed by the ibm and and also after db2 emerged ibm migrated nearly 700 sap customers from oracle to the db2 this shows that how efficiently the db2 is working and the db2 is also used for monitoring and storing the data and db2 is called as a next generation data platform and mostly the db2 is used for e-commerce online banking and the db2 is also used for data warehousing purpose and those are the uses of the db2 and this is the contents that we have discussed in the video for on the db2 lecture starting and in the next video we are going to see about the working of basic commands of linux or unix because as we are going to work on the db2 luw which which means linux unix and windows we need to know about the basic linux commands that will be useful while we are working on the db2 so i hope you all like the video so please share like and subscribe thanks hope you have a good day